Income tax 2023-2024, itemized deductions, charity gifts by cash or check, and other than by cash or check. Get ready and some coffee because we need extreme concentration when doing income tax preparation 2023-2024. Most of this information can be found in the instructions for Schedule A Tax Year 2023, which you can find on the IRS website at irs.gov, irs.gov. Looking at the income tax formula, we're focused on what I would call the below-the-line deductions, more specifically the itemized deductions. Remember, in the first half of the income tax formula, is basically a funny income statement. Most income statements having income minus expenses resulting in net income here having income minus various deductions resulting in taxable income noting deductions for taxes are good therefore we'll typically look for more of them and the difference between the above the line deductions first a word from our sponsor yeah actually we're sponsoring ourselves on this one because apparently the merchandisers they don't want to be seen with us but but that's okay whatever because our merchandise is, is better than their stupid stuff anyways. Like our, trust me, I'm an accountant product line. Yeah, it's paramount that you let people know that you're an accountant. Because apparently we're among the only ones equipped with the number crunching skills to answer society's current deep, complex, and nuanced questions. If you would like a commercial-free experience, consider subscribing to our website at accountinginstruction.com or accountinginstruction.thinkific.com. Adjustments to income and the below-the-line deductions include that the above-the-line deductions do not need to clear a hurdle such as the standard deduction in order for them to be useful, whereas the itemized deductions typically do need to clear the hurdle of the standard deduction before they are useful to the taxpayer. First page of the Form 1040 focused on line number 12, standard deduction or itemized deduction, taking the larger of the two. If we are itemizing, then we'll have the Schedule A. Schedule A is the itemized deductions. We see a list of some of the categories on the left, although this is not the entire schedule. Noting that the itemized deductions have to clear the standard deduction, standard deduction based primarily on filing status. So we'd want to memorize the hurdles to clear single filer 13850, married filing joint double to 27700, head of household in the middle 20,800. If they're over a certain age and or blind, we have an increase of those standard deductions. Here's for a single filer if one or two of those combo married filing joint where we have four combos that could be met to taxpayers two items and there's the related standard deductions 